Hey folks, and welcome back to Let's Play Civilization V. I am the Game Mechanic, and we are still playing as Rome. Um, we, in our last episodes, uh, finally took out Siam. This was his last city, so that's burning down. Um, and left on our to-do list here is to take out Nebuchadnezzar and Askia. Um... So one thing that's sort of happened is I, I, I let him go, you know, sort of unchecked. Uh, and by him, I mean Nebuchadnezzar. And so he has these A-bombs pretty much all over the place. There's one there, two there. He's got at least four, I'm guessing maybe five somewhere. Um, in our last videos, we saw a military rating, and basically it reflected the fact that he was... Pretty, pretty well stocked on the old nuclear warfare front there, um, which which poses some concern. Um, more than anything, I'm not concerned about being able to do it. I'm being I'm, I'm a little concerned with the stage of the game we're getting into. Um, <clears throat> turn 350 here, so 150 turns left, which seems like a lot, but if you look at our tech tree, we are pretty far away from getting, you know, these these last uh, techs that we need, and we don't need that top there. We, we I'd love the giant death robot, because that's awesome. Um, but, you know, we just did atomic theory here, so we still have to do the Manhattan Project um, to be able to get A-bombs, and then, you know, really, really mess some, some people up. <sighs> so what does that mean? What does that mean for us? Um, well... First, I mean, uh, to, to the point I first made at the beginning of this let, Let's Play, as far as not wanting to deal with, like, more than taking over five other civs, uh, yeah, you can see why now. <laughs> because it just gets a little tedious, and yeah, I mean, I didn't have to completely wipe people off the map. Um, but, you know, I, I, it's sort of fun to do it that way, too. Um... I would say we should be able to do it uh, if worse comes to worse. Yes, I know people are pissed because of that city. Um, if worse came to worse, uh, we could probably friend up some city states and grab a diplomatic victory out of this. Um, actually, one thing that we haven't checked that is important to check is victory progress. So if you look at victory progress, Nobody's got the Apollo program, um, even though our tech progress is getting close to the end there. We've taken out three. We have two left as far as um, what we were, our domination uh, objectives here. Diplomatic, we only have three votes. Um, we've got two city-state friends, and that's why we've got three votes. Babylon has one of five social policies for cultural. Um, so the only one that concerns me probably is... Um, is the space victory. You know, these guys have really successful, prosperous cities, um, probably pretty pretty darn high production. Um, and, you know, if they felt like it, they could probably bust out uh, a space victory on me. Um, that being said, I think one of my priorities going forward, as soon as we get a little bit more money, is to friend up some city-states. Um, Dublin, uh, to have like a, a foothold over here when we when we shoot over there is going to be helpful. Um, any any militaristic actually, I would have done this a long time ago if it wasn't for um, uh, Siam sort of impeding my progress. One other strategy I've sort of thought of here, and I'm not sure is this military? Yeah, Almady's militaristic too. Um, is to actually. Uh, sort of use this continent as um, like a decoy. Uh, like I think if, if I were to declare war with Nebuchadnezzar he would uh, use at least some of his nukes on the cities that he's closest to which I think would be over here. Um, and then when we do that we could maybe flank and come in from this angle or something like that. Um, I, I don't know. I mean, it, that seems a little crazy, and I don't know how much merit there is to it, but it might be worth trying. 
uh, just because I don't know how else to get rid of his nukes. Nukes uh, damage cities like a lot and destroy all surrounding units, which is sort of a pain in the butt. Um, so I'm actually reconsidering having these guys go join overseas uh, over here. Um, though at the same time this is probably the easiest route into uh, Ascius territory. So why don't we continue with that? What we can do... Um, yeah, I'm sort of abandoning these guys a little bit. Uh, but I think it'll be worth it. Oh, that's his territory too, isn't it? Alright, well, we'll go over there. Um, yeah, I, one thing I don't want to lose is all this military that I have here. Even though it's not that much, these units are super advanced, and that's awesome. Um, I mean, I could try to just declare war on him here and overwhelm, but if I stockpile all my units, I, I feel like I'm going to get nuked, so... Someone completed the Pentagon. Ask you did. Um, all right, so we'll continue with that strategy a little bit. In fact, let's go hang out in Warsaw. Or maybe like there. Um, have him go here for now, I suppose. Um, so I suppose we can go ahead and uh, deal with that city. I'm actually a little more concerned, not so much with that city, as to what else is going on in the ocean. Because um, uh, Askia's military score is pretty high as well. And uh, I don't know if he's got a nuke or something. I don't think so, because it was just slightly higher than ours. Um, so I don't, I don't think he's got nukes, but he's probably got a lot of military. I mean, if you look at how much military we have, and if he was close, then, you know, he's got to have a decent stronghold somewhere. Hmm, I could be wrong, of course. <clears throat> um, let's see, the other thing we should probably check is, oops, uh, our city list. And we need to get that Manhattan Project finished, which Rome is makes the most sense. Not 90 turns here with an 8 production city. And I know that that's actually tainted right now because of our extreme unhappiness here. Um, you lose uh, production. Greatly diminished. So, but still, um, I think we need to deal with that. And I'm thinking... Um... I know that a tank does a lot for us. Is there a building that we want? You know, I don't know why I've neglected workshops. Um, I, I really feel like I should have built workshops a long time ago. So... I'm gonna just... I know windmill would help it, but I think I'm just gonna dive right into uh, the Manhattan Project over there. And uh, we'll go from there. What are we researching? Flight? Well, we're going to need carriers. Fighters, I don't really care. I don't have moise. Um, so we're going to flight. I guess that makes sense. Bombers. Can those be held in bombers? Mm, no. Just aircraft carriers, which, okay, so... Four turns till that, and then we'll start building some aircraft. I'd like rocketry, too. Helicopter gunship has great mobility, and then uh, rocket artillery is sweet, because they don't have to set up. Um, and we've got some advanced artillery. I'd also like nuclear submarines. Visible to all use except destroyers and other submarines. Do I have any destroyers? All right, where are these guys? They're battleships. Okay, so we should almost get submarines or destroyers here. We've got some, um, let's see, we're all building stock exchanges, public school, infantry, 
circus. I don't know that that's... I don't know how useful that is. Um, yeah, okay, we'll leave it. Uh, all those are going to speed up as soon as we burn down this city. Who, who are you getting attacked from? Oh, that, again? that far away? Interesting. Boy, that guy's pretty injured. Okay, well that's helpful. I like great scientists. Um, I think after flight we could use them to pop... No, I don't know if I want to use them to pop radar. Could use them to just get nuclear fission. We don't necessarily need that right now until we finish the Manhattan Project though. Um, I think we'll just save him for the time being. All right. Uh, and you can just hang out for a little while. I think we can take down the city fairly easily. Terribly worried about uh, a strength two city, even if he does have some uh, fighters there. I, this guy actually needs to go heal up. Um, all right. All right. Now, do we want to grab any more land down here? Do I even care? We've got plenty of aluminum. Even though that's another eight. Um, meh. Meh. Yeah, it's okay. You can take the damage. Oh dear. There's more than I anticipated. should build so destroyers can see subs huh interesting um yeah they need a theater Guys, go in. 